Good evening. It's Poetry at the Altar with Juliana. I am going to tell you a little story first before I share the poem that I wrote. I went to roller skate at a local park in the area that I live in the other day and um, I was roller skating and then there's a river that goes through and so when I kind of skated by I was like wow that's a lot of swans there was like about well I counted them so there's not about I counted 30 and there was two that flew in swooped in flew into the water and that was really a cool experience to see so there was about 32 altogether but what I noticed was this one little loner swan over to the side and what I noticed about this swan was just that it was like on its own doing its own thing so but at the same time of being on its own doing the own thing there was this group that was there and like you know you could just tell that they supported each other and so in the times that I felt alone in my life I've always had a group of some sort to come back to and I'm really grateful for that and so you know but sometimes it's necessary for you to kind of go in inward by yourself and then realize that there's a supporting community around you and I think that with everything happening right now there's a lot of that happening um, there's a lot of just a lot I don't I don't even have any more words to say for it um, there's a lot of emotions going and I think it's important to be real with them within so I'm gonna leave that alone and not say any more about that um, but I will read this and hopefully it will land with you and help you and you feel something in this even if it's one person that it helps I think that's enough um, okay so I will read this dig into your soul beneath the exterior and the mask you wear Hold on to your dreams. Let them speak to you. Deep within your heart, you find your treasure, discovering endless possibilities from the pain you have endured. You are strong. Allow, receive, and surrender that strength, allowing it to transmute into wisdom of the humble warrior. For you have gazed into the unknown the past, present, and future. You have co-created the blank slate. Clear all of the attachments you have held so tightly to. The grip has loosened and the veil is lifted. You have gone beyond what the ear can hear, the eye can see, the hand can touch, the tongue can taste, and the nose can smell. You have discovered what the heart has to show you. Love. Love to another. Love to self. And love to the unknown. So, anyways, I just wanted to share that tonight. <clears throat> share my crystal that I just got. These are really cool. This one's a fuchsite with rubies in, within it. And then a fluorite the other day which is really really pretty it's kind of got like green and purple and clear kind of crystal in it but um, I just wanted to share that I went actually I stopped skating I got in my car and I drove around to this special place under the bridge by um, the river and I went under there and that's when I wrote this poem and then I was reading a book and there was a poem in the beginning of the book that connected so well to what I had just written and it was really really special so um, I just hope that that lands with someone and helps them in the time of despair um, and that we can you know 
learn to take action with love and hopefully make some changes in this world because it, in my heart I feel that that's so necessary. It's been necessary for a long time and I think there's some people that are finally ready to make a change and ready to do something about it. I know I've learned a lot in the last couple of weeks myself and about other people and their experiences and my experience is not that but that doesn't mean that I can't try to understand and do something different so thank you so much for joining I appreciate you liking subscribing and commenting and sharing this video with others thank you bye